<clears throat> Hello, I'm Brian Kelly, Communications and IT Volunteer for the Morris Federation. And in this talk, I'll be talking about the value of setting up a Google business profile or how to get your side on Google Maps. Try it. Do a Google search for find a Morris side near me or similar. You can pause the recording, try it and then come back. When I tried it two years ago, I found information for Dr. Turboville's Morris, but nothing for Morris, Wild Morris, my local side. So what I did, I discovered you needed to create a Google business profile. So I created one, a few minutes work. So it's easy. You just have to fill in a, a few boxes, no IT skills needed, and that's all documented on the Morris Fed's IT resources section. That's what the page looks like. And once created, it may take a few day, days for the uh, new business to be verified, and then you can add additional information such as photos and videos. It's the type of thing that you can add, name, type of organization, address, website, and the description. And then after a month or so, you'll get some insights. And you can find it might be very popular, the number of views on a search, the textual search, and also the number of times it appears on a map. Why the popularity? So here was a search for a side near me, various sides that we can find. Obviously, there are many more sides around, but they seem not to have a Google business profile. And so perhaps are missing out on this. But if we look at the popularity, photos and videos make the thing really stand out more and the ratings and the reviews. We've got one, one review and a five-star rating, as have Dr. Turboville's other sides around, which may or may not have any ratings or reviews. And reviews can influence people and the decisions. Just try it, so like restaurants near me and look at what's available, this is near me, and look at the top one, 4.7 ratings, 399 people have given a rating and there's a nice description there which helped me get a feel for the place. Although if there's no description, it's not certain. So try that and get a feel for what works. So getting a review, I think, can work. And here's the review for Wild Morris, five star, and look at that lovely description. And this was actually from a lady who invited us to a post-lockdown street party. She asked us, she thanked us afterwards. And I said, thank you for that. But could you add it to Google, our Google business profile, which she did. And she also added these lovely photos, really nice photos. So getting her reviews, you could ask an organizer of events, you could ask your friends and families, maybe ask your peers, the other Morris sides that you know, or you can also think about giving reviews to other sides. So go to a festival and the ones that you really like, why not give them a review? Or you can write one for yourself. Some people may feel uneasy about doing that, but it is an option. I should mention something about the quirks of searching. You get different results for Morris Side near me, Morris Team near me, and even Club Ensemble and Troop. And you also get different results if you make these plural as well. So final thoughts. It can be very simple to create a Google Business Profile. The text, the photos, videos are important. Frequently asked questions might be useful. I looked at what I did. It was a video about come and learn, interest in learning Morris and a bit of a sales pitch, a promotion for coming along and joining us. Some nice photos and then this question and answer. Are we dancing out in public yet? 
I wrote that during lockdown, but clearly I need to update that. So there are issues about updating and also the governance, who owns that profile and what happens if they leave the team. So some thoughts for you, some questions for you. Do you think that would be useful? Will you create a profile? What doubts or concerns may you have? Thank you.